What do we know so far about the global health emergency declared by the World Health Organization? Welcome to the briefing. Today we delve into the alarming situation of M-pox, a disease caused by the monkeypox virus, which has recently been declared a global health emergency. The epicenter of this health crisis is the Democratic Republic of Congo, or DRC, where more than 15,600 cases and 537 deaths have been reported. This is not a localized issue, however. The virus has crossed borders, with cases now confirmed in 13 countries. The driving force behind this outbreak is a new strain of the virus known as Clade 1B. Unlike its predecessors, this strain spreads more easily through close contact, making it a formidable adversary in our fight against disease. The most affected demographic is children, a fact that further underscores the urgency of the situation. This is not the first time the world has faced an outbreak of this nature. Back in 2022, a different MPOX outbreak, fueled by the Clade 2B strain, affected regions where the virus was previously non-endemic. While Australia may seem far from the heart of the crisis, the situation is being closely monitored, with concerns about the virus evolving to transmit more efficiently. The best line of defense against outbreaks like this is, of course, vaccination. However, accessibility proves to be a significant challenge, particularly in Africa, where the majority of cases are located. In response to this, the World Health Organization has triggered the emergency use listing for MPOX vaccines, a move designed to accelerate access in lower income countries. This is a rapidly evolving situation and understanding it is crucial. Stay aware, stay informed, and most importantly, stay safe. This has been your briefing on the global health emergency declared by the World Health Organization.